In Vermilion Parish, a Texas woman says she's going through a mix of emotions after learning her husband was allegedly part of a scheme to get a fraudulent divorce. News 10's Rodrigo Taylor reports how the husband's girlfriend allegedly impersonated the wife. It's a story you'll see only on 10. Tequila Mouton says she and her husband have two kids and have been married for 12 years. She thought all was well in her marriage only to discover her husband allegedly got a fake divorce with her. She says the other shocking part is her husband's mistress allegedly pretended to be her. I feel like I'm on a lifetime movie trying to put these puzzle, this puzzle together to see how did it even took place? How did the attorney did the information without my identification? Mouton, who now lives in Texas, says she has been traveling back and forth to Louisiana gathering information on how she could be divorced. My husband did not contact me, he told me anything about he's want, he wanted to divorce me, didn't tell me that he filed for a divorce. Uh, if he wanted a divorce, I would have gave it to him. He says she never received a subpoena or was present in court proceedings. She tells News 10 she learned of the divorce through his mistress. You've been divorced. It's public record. Guess what? You've seen that ring? Guess what? I'm about to be married to him next. So you can get ready. I'll give you an invitation. Mouton says according to the state and her attorney, she and her husband are still married. However, according to St. Martin Parish, the court did grant a divorce, but it's not finalized. The accused mistress mistress is LaShonda Pope. She was arraigned in Vermilion Parish Courthouse Thursday morning for first degree injuring public records. If we would have been done the, the, the proper way, but it was not done properly because on the paperwork that I've finally gathered after two years, uh, is a whole lot of information on there that is not correct. She says there was incorrect spelling of names, birthdays, and addresses. I just want peace and I want justice to be served because anybody that knows the, the law knows that how long it takes for a divorce to take place, especially with kids. I really don't know how to feel uh, that a person could actually steal your identity and get away with it. News 10 reached out to Pope and Mouton's husband, who both declined to add comments. We also reached out to their attorney, who declined to comment. In Vermilion Parish, Rodrigo Taylor, KLFY News 10.